During this morning's mass, we were reminded that the greatest
that everybody had to be enrolled in a census. So, Joseph went from Galilee, from the town of Nazareth, down to Bethlehem, to the city of David, because he was of the house of David. And he took with him Mary, who was with child. But if Jesus wasn't born, I certainly wouldn't be a priest. If Jesus wasn't born, you wouldn't be here in this school. We wouldn't have Catholic schools. If Jesus wasn't born, well, you'd go to school somewhere, I guess, but it wouldn't be here. If Jesus wasn't born, many of you wouldn't know each other. You certainly wouldn't know me. You wouldn't know Mr. Clackness. You wouldn't know your teachers. What would it have been like if Jesus wasn't born? Think about that for a moment. Well, I know my life would be very, very, very empty because almost every single friend I have, I met because I'm Father Tony, I'm a priest, and know all the different places where I've worked in various different churches. That's where I met all my friends. Everybody I know in my life all of my Facebook friends and all the people I know in my life came into my life because Jesus was born. And if he wasn't born, boy, I think my life would be pretty empty. It would be very empty. So as I think about Jesus' birthday, I think there's one simple word that comes to my mind. Thank you. Thank you, Jesus for coming into this world. But because of you, I learned how to live my life better. I've come to meet some fantastic people, and I come to share the journey with many, many people all through my life. How my life would be empty without Jesus. For the church, that all followers of Jesus may be a source of light to the world. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. For world leaders, that Jesus may turn their minds and hearts to thoughts of peace. We pray to the Lord. Lord, hear our prayer. Through him and with him and to him, him O God Almighty Father, in the unity of the Holy Spirit, all glory and honor is yours. Forever and ever. Amen. 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 Heaven, hallowed be thy name. Thy kingdom come. Thy will be done on earth as it is in heaven. Give us this day our daily bread. And forgive us our trespasses as we forgive those who trespass against us. And lead us not to temptation, but deliver us from evil.
Before the final blessing, I just want to say a thank you to all of you boys and girls here and all of you who are watching up in the classrooms. Uh, thank you so much for always making my Christmas so special. Whenever I hear you singing, whenever I hear uh, the, your beautiful voices and your happiness and joy of Christmas, it really does make me feel happy. Even in these times when otherwise I could feel so down and, and discouraged, I feel so happy being with all of you. And I'm so grateful that you could be here with me today to celebrate Christmas Mass. And thank all of our upper grade people who are watching on video. As we're going to soon, we'll be listening to the fourth graders sing Silent Night. And as they sing Silent Night, I'm going to go right upstairs and bring Holy Communion uh, to the upper grades then as well. Boys and girls, God bless you all. Have a blessed and beautiful celebration of Christmas. And be safe. Be happy, and we'll see you in a new year when, oh, great things are going to happen in 2021. The Lord be with you. And with your spirit. May Almighty God bless us all, the Father, the Son, and the Holy Spirit. Amen. Go in peace, glorifying God by your life. Thanks be to God. And for greatest, let's hear you sing, Silent Night.